morning everybody how are you all doing today hope you're doing well um it is nine o'clock so i'm starting a little bit later today um but i've got a really busy day with loads of phone calls so i thought i'm gonna have a leisurely get ready i've gone for a nice strong lip today because i felt like i needed to um let's do a quick outfit of the day because this has become a little tradition hasn't it so just a pink vest nice long blue cardi because i get cold and then some jeans that's about it today now i just did um a bit of a comparison photo because it's transformation tuesday um for all you instagrammers the trouble is um the, out, the underwear that I was wearing when I had my very first photo taken, my before photos, is now too big for me. I can't wear it. So obviously that's a good sign. However, the comparison photos now are not going to look similar because it's something different. Um, but I did it this morning anyway, just to see. And it's kind of disheartening because I was doing really well. And I, I know that I... I know that I've looked different. I'm not, you know, I'm not under any illusions. I know I look different, so I'm not saying that I don't. But when I looked at my photos just now, it makes me realise I've still got a really, really long way to go. Um, and, you know, I'm OK with that. That's OK. It's just, it feels like um, I've been doing this forever. So I'm going to stick it out. You know this. You know I'm not going to come off plan. It's like never been my intention so it's okay but it does make you feel a bit like sometimes but you get days like that don't you um you're gonna get days where you're a bit fed up and everything's a bit pants i'll insert the clips and you can tell me what you think but i've got a long way to go i was gonna sneeze no no <laughs> yes <laughs> i did sneeze right well i'm gonna get a litre of water make a start on that i've already had one black coffee um i'm hoping that my flav drops will turn up today because i fancy a porridge but i don't want to use my porridges until my flav drops are here because i'm just screaming for a chocolate um peanut butter porridge i think that's going to be well nice anyway that's where i am today just got to my desk um logged in and i'm going to start my day so I will keep you posted every step of the way, as usual, with boring rambles and nonsense. Bye! Just having coffee number two. Um, I'm plodding through a piece of work that I'm looking at at the moment, so that's okay. And I've got litre number two sitting over there. Um, I've had a message to say that the Hermes driver has got my flave drops and they will be with me today. Now, my luck will be that they'll arrive at like four o'clock, but I'd really like them to arrive at about half one two so I can have a porridge because I fancy a porridge today but I'm determined not to have one until my flav drops arrive um so if they're not here by then then I'll just have to have one tomorrow instead but I'll unbox them when they arrive and I'm super excited I'm going to put a little drop on my tongue of each one and tell you what I think I know a couple of you have ordered them so it's exciting it's nice to have something new isn't it um and also I've realized that I was being a bit of a dick about my um progress photos because i put them on instagram and i've had some really lovely comments back people saying how good i look and like you know you kind of need to hear that sometimes because when you look at yourself you're your biggest critic and i look and i see somebody who's still really overweight and doesn't look very nice um and everybody else has been really positive and super lovely about it so i need to just to stop being a, a dick <laughs> and accept it so anyway there we go that's my little rant um and i will be back when i take my lunch which will probably be oh god i'm on space on a telly kit right now so i better go and answer that and then i'll be back when i can what delights shall i have today i think it's gonna have to be strawberry and apple bar yum 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 so i've come out into the garden with my strawberry and apple bar and my water it's not overly hot out here like it's actually quite the breeze is quite chilly but i just needed some fresh air i've had a really really busy morning super productive but really really busy so um this is nice to be out here and having a bit of a wind down although my children have decided to come and run around oh it's a bit too chilly actually guys i think mummy's gonna come in because that's actually a bit chilly out there <laughs> go out then i was gonna sit out there everybody but that felt a little bit cold so i've come in 
and sit myself in the corner. Hey, Mummy, guess what? Hey, Mummy. Yes, Oliver. Oh, okay. I will be back in a bit. I was just about to eat my bar and then the doorbell went and something turned up. Da, 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 flame drops. So what I'm going to do is make my porridge and then we'll do a little bit of a taste test. So bear with me while I make my porridge and then we'll try them. So I've made the porridge. Um, I did, my little boy came in to see what I'd got and he tasted a bit of the chocolate peanut butter one on his tongue. And he said it was awful on the tongue, so I'm guessing it's not the best way to try it. So I'm not going to try them all on my tongue, but I am going to put the chocolate one in my porridge. I've got the white chocolate and I've got the maple and I'm super excited. So as it said, like zero calories, zero fat, zero sugar. So you are allowed them. And now the instruction is, so each bottle contains about 100 servings. So that's amazing. And it says add between seven and ten drops of it to your desired food or beverage. Adjust serving size to taste. Ten drops is equivalent to 0.5 mils. So let's do chocolate peanut butter. We'll do this. Suck some more up. And then we'll go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So it's basically one whole pipette, isn't it? Let's mix that in. Oh my god, the smell. The smell, guys, the smell. Let's just hope it tastes all right. I can't believe it arrived just as I was coming down to get my lunch. I was made up. Actually, I thought it was my nails at first because the box had um, look fantastic on it. I was like, oh, my nails are turned up. But no. Oh. My. Word. Oh my goodness, that is such a game changer. People get online, order some of them. That is lovely in coffee. I mean, that is gonna be bloody lovely in coffee. I think the white chocolate one in a vanilla shake is gonna be amazing, game changer. Um, you could do that as a mousse. You could do that as a thick shake, like an ice cream. These are even gonna be great, like when I'm done, and I'm maintaining, um, they'll be fantastic to have in porridge in the mornings because that sweetens it up, makes it really creamy. That is absolutely delicious. I recommend them. Oh, and when you logged on and ordered them, because I was spending more than 10 pounds, I got to choose a free gift and you could have a um, 30 day subscription to something, I can't remember what it was, like an online magazine, or you could have this. And given the current situation, I opted for this, I've got a little cleansing hand gel as well. So there we go, this is going to be my lunch today. It's unreal, actually unreal, it tastes like chocolate peanut butter. You've got to get some people, you have to get some. me finished for the day um super productive loads done um feel like i contributed which is really nice um i'm gonna go downstairs and cook the boys some dinner i think they're gonna have ravioli tonight just something nice and quick um don't know what my husband's gonna have but i've got a feeling he'd quite like spaghetti and sausages on toast because that's another one that's nice and easy but we'll see what he fancies um I don't know what I'm having tonight. I don't know whether to have a pesto pasta, whether to have a cottage pie, or whether to have a spag bowl. <gasps> the choices. Um, and I might mix things up and have a chocolate chewy bar instead of caramel bites. But, you know, I don't want to throw out any bad mojo and ruin my usual routine. <laughs> I've already done that today by adding something new to my porridge. I'm a woman who can't be tamed, aren't I? Um yeah i think i'm gonna log off now um i might have a white chocolate coffee <laughs> i'll let you know what it tastes like is that gonna work i don't know if that'll work um or a maple coffee but i feel like i want to try something else because well i've got them so why not um and i've had that's my third liter which is 
pretty much gone um, and I've had three coffees so four coffees would be fine won't it I'll have that while the boys are having their dinner then I don't feel like I'm missing out right let's log off what are you lot doing this evening anybody doing anything fun if you're doing something fun this evening comment below and tell me what you're doing because I just get bored of staying in um Friday Friday Saturday Saturday will be quite good fun because um the group that I'm part of the um amateur dramatic group we are having an online show so they did it about four weeks ago and I didn't participate I watched it and I supported everybody that had uploaded a video to our page but I didn't um, submit anything but I'm going to this time I'm going to sing um, Where the Lost Things Go from Mary Poppins I'm going to do a funny sketch like a monologue funny monologue um, or a bit of um, Shirley Valentine and then I'm also singing in a group with a couple of my friends that we're doing over Zoom and we're going to be doing um, He Had It Coming from Chicago so that's going to be good I think I'm doing the Cicero bit so that'll be great what I might do and if I'm feeling brave on Saturday is insert some clips of me doing my my thing if I decide I want to um but yeah that's all for now I will be back later on hello so the boys are all tucked up in bed and I've put on a jumper because I'm freezing again um yeah I'm probably gonna have a cottage pie for dinner because I fancy it and I had pasta last night so I don't know if I want pasta again tonight so I'm gonna have a cottage pie I think um I'm gonna watch something on the telly um and I might get an early night because I'm really tired I'm not hungry though I could probably go to bed and not have anything I've not been hungry at all today um I was looking forward to my porridge but not because I was hungry but because I was just wanting to try my new stuff um i didn't have a white chocolate coffee in the end i decided against the idea um yeah so yeah i'll have my cottage pie and i'll come back on briefly and say that i'm eating it so you know i am and apart from that i'm gonna be done for the night i think i'll upload this and then i might go to bed because i'm a tired girl I fancy some gin. Cravings don't go away whether you're hungry or not. And here is my delicious bowl of cowpat or chunky um, baby food or could be a little bit of like peanut butter as well so you know use my imagination but anyway at least it tastes good. So I've eaten my cottage pie, that was very nice, and now I'm having my sorted caramel bites. I know I was going to have something different, but I just can't. They're my favourite, so I'm going to eat them. Um, and I'm going to go now because I'm worn out and it's been a long day. So I will speak to you all tomorrow. Have a lovely evening. Bye.